Well, it's time for an end of the day service. This is a routine we do every day. When we are done working. Fuel up in grease. And death fluid. ahead and get that going sticks like to fling up mud I have to wash it only grease the boom about once a week that's really all you need to once or twice depending on how many hours you use it here comes Timmy up it is nice that all these lines are right here it makes greasing a lot easier he's gonna, he's gonna pull up behind me all right let me let the boom down size bucket I've been happy with it and let the thumb down and you can grease everything else from right here go ahead and cut it off now that it's cooled off You like my head cam, Tammy? <laughs> You're like, what the hell does he have on his head? I mean, a lot of airsoft people wear those things too, so I wasn't gonna laugh too much. <laughs> I figured you were already recording too. I'm like, I'm not gonna make fun of you. Hey, <laughs> uh, you can make fun of me all you want. I'll make fun of you back. It's a team effort. <laughs> I got some grease on the track right there if you need some more. Now, it being brand new, everything's nice and tight so it doesn't take an ungodly amount of grease. Especially when you're just clearing and we're out of grease. change this out throw that in the burn pile in the morning continue greasing yeah it just squirts right out
and that's done now we'll hit our boom fittings up here i need to clean this track off so i can got a step <laughs> So these two are for your boom down here and then the next three are for your your boom lift cylinders so they don't need a extreme amount of grease if not it'll end up dripping off making a mess and now the fuel is full let me cut that off and put the def fluid in there too. This machine uses about three quarters of a gallon today. They got me. Oh, right in the dirt. Now we'll take a whole gallon next time. Turntable, you only grease it every 250 hours. So you'll blow the dust seal out. All right, ready for tomorrow morning. It's about 6:30 Friday morning over here where the 220 is. My uncle's been out here digging for the last couple of days. Looks like he's made pretty good progress getting all this sediment piled up. You kind of see he's got that dug out and transferred over to the shoreline. Got the mats right here. But yeah, he's getting, just laying it back from the edge getting it all transferred over to the edge over here so it can be loaded out a lot of sediment mm. it'd be good for fields somewhere it's a lot of sand a little sand and gravel so i don't know and eh, it's probably got too much rock in it to be nice to put in a yard or anything i don't know it grows willow tree is good
But, uh, yeah. Yeah, it looks like the lake's about dry down there. Hmm. <laughs> He's got a fair amount of dough. Hopefully today he should get all that cut and laid back. And then I may come next week and move a little bit more back. We'll just get it all piled up and cleaned out of here. A lot of sand.